Good morning, everyone. So I've actually just come out to get my hair done. It was a really spontaneous thing. Really like this hairdresser, and they posted something on their Instagram the other day saying that they've got an emerging stylist, and you could get like your hair dyed and cut for like super super cheap. So I was like, might as well book it. My hair. I think the last time I got my hair done was January, like the very early on in January. I'm not sure if you can see, but like I've got some regrowth. And when I first got this done, I remember thinking that the girl did it quite like an ashy blonde, and I like more of like a warm warm like like you've just spent the summer in the sun kind of blonde like very glowy i'm hoping to get that done today also just a little trim because my hair just needs a bit of a trim and i kind of slept in a little bit today so i didn't have time to have breakfast so i've brought this little coconut yogurt and also a banana i'm literally going to like spoon it into my mouth and then eat the banana so i'm like eating them together but i've got like five minutes to eat this so i'm just gonna sit here Enjoy my breakfast and then go in. I don't know how long this is going to take. I feel like hair appointments always take so much longer than you think. So I've dedicated like three hours. I'm hoping it won't be that much longer. So yeah, anyway, I'm going to continue eating my breakfast and then head on in. from getting my hair done now. I'll try and like set it up so you can see. So that is it from the back. I love it so much. I specifically asked her for like really like warm, like kind of like honey caramel, kind of like blonde, not ashy at all. And I just like, how nice is that color? That is honestly like my favorite color of blonde ever. Also got a bit of a trim, so it just feels so healthy. Who would have thought my hair would feel so healthy after like getting blonde in it? I will put all of her details here and then also link her Instagram below as well because honestly, if you live on the Sunshine Coast, this is genuinely like the best haircut and hair like coloring I've ever had. The only bad experience about that whole outing was I got a parking ticket. I've only had one parking ticket for like my whole entire life. And that was when I was at my old job and it was literally like more money that I earned that entire shift. I was so annoyed. But they've only recently, like, like when I say recently, probably in like the last year, put a three hour time limit on the amount that you can park where I parked. And um, I literally got the ticket. Okay, get this. Got the ticket at 12.57 and I got to my car at 1.04. cannot believe it, I'm so annoyed. Like I usually feel like these kind of things teach you a lesson because like when I parked in the place at work, I kind of knew I wasn't supposed to park there, but I was just kind of like, eh, like I'll park there. But this one, I just thought that you could park there for more than three hours, but you couldn't. Anyway, I've just come home, made some lunch because I'm literally starving after only having the banana and the coconut yogurt for breakfast. So I've just made myself a massive nourish bowl. My camera's flashing, so I'm going to try and go through this really, really quickly. Basically, it's... Okay, yeah, my camera ended up dying. I just got on charge right now, so I thought I would grab out my phone and just film my lunch. Basically, it's just the meal prepped like sweet potato and pumpkin that I meal prepped yesterday. And then I've got some avocado, some black sesame seeds, some spinach, one cut up tomato. And then I make like this tahini, paprika, onion dressing with a bit of salt and pepper. And yeah, that is my lunch. It is literally like huge. I'm not sure if you can see. I am starving. So I'm very, very excited to eat.
out of my body balance class it's honestly hands down my favorite workout class to do like it's so relaxing but also super challenging like you're shaking you're sweating i think i have talked about it on my channel before but body balance if you don't know is a mixture between pilates tai chi and yoga which is just like so good because if you get bored doing like one of them you get a bit of everything you work on like flexibility and balance and like just strength you do like core exercises and you literally work like every part of the body it's just like i swear i could talk about this for so long because it's hands down my favorite workout to do also it was so cold this morning like i think we're just going through a little bit of like a cold phase at the moment i literally did not want to get out of bed i had no motivation but i feel so much better that i actually got my butt to the gym i think now i kind of want to go for a walk it's actually beautiful weather today like even though it's a little bit cold it's nice in the sun and the skies are like clear blue i think i want to go for like a bit of a walk at the beach or something I might ask my dad if he wants to come with me and if not i'll just kind of like pop in a podcast and go for a walk last night i actually put up an instagram post about my weekly goals this week and one of my goals was to do 10,000 steps every single day so in order to do that because i do spend a lot of time on my laptop editing and stuff like that i kind of need to go for a walk every single day so yeah i want to go for like a nice beach walk today oh so cute ready shake good boy sit sit good boy oh <laughs> he pronounced it shake Good boy. Drop. No. Drop. Oh, and roll over. <laughs> Look. You're such a good boy. All right, I'm hot. <laughs> You think it's so funny. I know, I do. Okay, I'm home now and it is now stopped. Okay, so what we're making today is. Oh. <laughs> so what we're making. Lighting's bad, or like my camera on soup and are you focusing? Yeah. <laughs> okay, well this is literally the most soapy thing ever. Actually just about to go on the walk I was saying before. My lunch has been the most random thing ever because I've just been sitting in the kitchen just like eating whatever. So I've been eating this cold pumpkin soup, which was dinner like a few nights ago. And then also some of this like leftover veggie pasta. I'm kind of just in one of those like really indecisive moods so I'm probably just gonna have like a bit more of that pasta a little bit more of this pumpkin soup and yeah I don't even know what I feel like you know in just those days where you don't know what you feel like I feel like I'm having one of those days so anyway I'm gonna keep eating that and the pasta and then we're gonna head out for our walk clearly just in the weirdest most indecisive mood today so I've just got a little bit of hummus and a carrot as well Can you just get it there <laughs> I don't walk like that. <laughs> what are you... <laughs> oh my god, look how beautiful this is. Oh, You're oh, thanks. Back to me. <laughs> when I wake up, wake up, wake up. Okay, we've just been doing our walk for probably like an hour now, and we decided to run a little bit. I tell you what, my cardio fitness right now is not peaking. Did you struggle with that run? Yes, I did. It needs a lot of improvement. Yeah, we were just talking that maybe we should do a marathon, and then yeah. after doing that, I was like, mm. we are all done now. So we ended up walking around 6k, I think it was in the end. And which is good because my goal, well lately I've been trying to walk slash run 5Ks a day. I've honestly found that like going for those 5K walks a day or like aiming to get 10,000 steps in a day has just like, I am I feel like I'm never really, I know this is gonna sound stupid, but like not really bloated that much anymore. And like, I just feel like it's helping to really like lean me up. Does that make sense? Walks are just really, really good for your body. I feel like because they're so just like, they're really easy, they don't stress your body out or anything. Yeah, we were just kind of like walking and then I was like, do you want to just like try run for a bit? And after like a minute of running, I regretted it because I'm just not fit running wise. Neither am I, don't worry. Oh, 
Okay, so it's currently the next day after what you've just seen. I've had the most craziest like 24 hours ever. I will go into all of it in the next couple of videos, but um, basically there's a lot of exciting things happening at the moment. I look a little bit dead because I had to get up at 4 this morning and it's just been a massive day. But I was just editing this video on the train and it's already like getting a bit too long, so I'll explain everything in my next vlog. I actually think that I'm getting to a really good place with my body and stuff and I feel like it's, it's very healthy. I'm not like retaining that fat that I was before. So I really, really recommend that tip of like trying to do a 5k walk slash jog a day or just like aiming for 10,000 steps. Also things like body balance, like the class I did are so good at toning and honestly like my stomach and my arms, even my legs, like everything is just seeming to be like toning up quite nicely at the moment. And that's the majority of what I'm doing. So I'm definitely like putting it down to that. So yeah, anyway, I'm going to go now. I'm going to quickly edit this video and get it up because it's just been a crazy day and I really, really want to get this video up. So yeah, I'm really babbling now. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.